Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Today I will be showing you how I make Maui back or Maui drink Canadian style. If you're interested, keep watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Put in the post notification bell so you don't miss a video. Let's go. So to make our Maui back concentrate, we need the following ingredients. Here I have my spices which include bay leaf, cloves, some star anise as well as a uh, orange peel and I also have here my cinnamon sticks and of course the mobby bag. Let's go. To a pot I am going to start off by adding in some water. Also I want you to comment below and let me know how you make your mobby concentrate. Next I am going to follow up with all of the aforementioned uh, ingredients. Once that has been added, I am going to cover the pot and allow it to boil for roughly 15 minutes thereabout. That is uh, to help extract all the goodness from the spices and the mobby bag. Here it is, as you can see, it's boiling and actually it is done. So what I will do is to remove it from the heat and allow it to cool. I just decided to give you a more closer look as to what the mobby concentrate looks like. So it's been quite about maybe a few minutes after but it's not quite cool yet and of course at uh, the time that I did this video it was actually kind of late at night and I wanted to demonstrate one time for you guys. So I will pour out some of that concentrate even though it's not cool completely. So I'm just turning out some of the bark here, the bark or the mobile concentrate here. And as you can see, it's still very, very hot. But what you can do is allow it to cool completely, or that is what I would normally do before I begin to use. But as I said, for the purposes of this video, we are going to head straight into the demo of how I make the mommy drink. So next, what I'm going to do is to place it into a mug and as I said don't forget to comment below and let me know how you make yours so at first when I was adding the concentrate to the mug I started by using my measuring cup and then I was like why are you using a measuring cup just go ahead and pour all of the concentrate inside and of course this is why you see me measuring out here I don't know why I did that <laughs> But anyhow, we are going to move on and pour everything into the mug, which I did do. And next, we are going to add water to it. Now, the thing with mobby is that it has this bitter, strong taste. So some people like it that way, some people like it not so much so. All you have to do is to add more or less water depending on the strength of your mobby drink that you prefer. So once I've added the water, I'm just going in with my sweetener, which is brown sugar. White sugar can be used as well. And I'm just going to sweeten that to taste or liking. Next, we are going to add in some vanilla extract, which helps to pop the flavor of the mobby drink. And I was extremely generous with adding in that concentrate. As I said, I will leave a link in the description box below with all of the ingredients and the amount that I use. Next, I am just going to pour some into some uh, into a glass, sorry, with ice. And as I said before, usually I allow everything to cool completely and then make it, which and allow it to sit open it as a matter of fact, and then drink it the next day. It is so much better. All the things would have had a chance to marry together and all the good stuff. But I really do hope that you did enjoy this video of me making the Mobby Bark drink the medium style. And as always, leave your comments. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye!